Hello everyone. I am Harry Chimp's wife, Hilary. We've been together for quite a long time now and we have three lovely kids. Harry Jr. is three, Henrietta is six and Fred's nine. Very smart little monkeys they are. Here's a little video I did of them recently. Aren't they just gorgeous little treasures? Say hello children. Hello. Hello everyone. G'day. How's it hanging mate? Oh Fred, you just take after your father so much. Harry's been a country amber for many years now and he used to enjoy his job and he had a real passion for it. He'd come home excited about his work and especially after he qualified as an advanced life support paramedic he felt that with his, with his ALS skills he could actually give a good level of care to his patients. Initially he studied really hard and gained his ALS skills because he thought, like most of his peers, that eventually he'd be rewarded and recognised for his commitment, skills and good faith with a reasonable rise in his pay and possibly even some back pay. He was absolutely gobsmacked when his own so-called senior management actually came out and said that what he did in his work was really of no particular increase in his skills base and it didn't warrant any increase in allowance for it. Eventually he did get a small allowance. His MICA colleagues hardly got any increase in allowances despite having all the skills that they have. His whole demeanour changed towards work and eventually he became to almost hate it. He was taking heaps of sick leave and seemed to be very stressed nearly all the time. Unfortunately, his passion not only gone for the job, but for me as well. We had lots of passion once. We argue much more and the kids have suffered as well and become unhappy and answer back much more. Harry stopped helping them with homework and didn't play games with them much like as much as he used to. He started drinking heavier than he used to as well. I have a little video here to show you of the kids. They used to get along so well but now they have started fighting and it upsets me so. When I asked Fred what he thought of Dad's job and he'd like to become a paramedic, he said, Yuck, no way. He often said that the type of patients he deals with has changed big time and that more often than not he'd be verbally and physically abused. Not so long back he could go to work and feel relatively safe, but not now. He's had knives pointed at him, been bitten, threatened with syringes, baseball bats and many other things. Some of these threats even come from some of the older patients and from patients that you'd least expect. He was getting calls to stupid little things day and night. He was even called out once to settle someone's baby at 3am because it wouldn't settle. Can you imagine that? Some of his friends said they got called out because Someone kicked the pillow off the end of their bed and they said they were too tired to pick it up and would they mind picking it up for him. Oh, dear you what? It seems rare for him these days to go to a good job where skills are actually required. It doesn't seem to matter which government is in, they seem to love to attack the ambos. I can't understand this, it's almost like bullying. I hope myself that if he ever has to go to one of these pollies as a patient, that he takes his time. But he wouldn't do that, he's too dedicated. Our friends don't swing over any more for Kappa or Barbie, and Harry seems to be at work even more trying to pick up overtime to help pay the bills. And this gets him all, all the more stressed and tired. He is constantly exhausted, and after night shifts, he is so tired he drops off to sleep on the sofa. But only for a short time and then he has trouble sleeping normally. I can't remember the last time he woke saying he felt he had a good sleep. As a morning person, I'm often missing out as well. Often he says he is so tired and stressed that he is terrified of making a wrong decision 
were giving a wrong drug or dose. His work partner at the time is also feeling the same way, but between them they seem to get through it. I am desperately worried about him because he's not coping very well and that we as a family are suffering badly and I can't handle this much more. I want him to find another job but he just can't seem to be able to get motivated to look for another job and go through an interview process, especially if it was like the one he had to go through recently at work. Huh. Jobs for the boys, he'd say. I'll never get one of those positions. I could just keep going on and on, but I've said enough for the time being. Harry's had to work Christmas and New Year this year, and some of the people are just unbelievable what they get up to. But he's just hoping that one day they'll get a nice EBA result and get the recognition that is worthwhile to the community. Well, thanks for that, and bye for now.